Hey everyone, today I'm excited because I have the pink um, Enchantix Bloom doll. That's a Walmart exclusive. She came out um, a couple days ago is when a lot of people started to find her. But she's been on eBay for probably since sometime last week or two weeks ago. I don't remember exactly. But yeah, she's really cool. And if anyone pre-ordered her from Entertainment Earth's website, they sent out emails to anyone who pre-ordered them that they weren't getting them in, which is probably because she's a Walmart exclusive and Entertainment Earth doesn't sell exclusives, but I still wonder how they were the first people to have it on their website, if it's not even their exclusive. So in the upper left-hand corner, there is a black heart. Then on the side it says Bloom in black and it's a special edition. Up here it says special edition, again, and then here's the doll. The background is shimmery and pink, it's like a foil. And then they have a Believix Bloom in pink on the side, and I don't know how, why they have to put Believix Bloom on everything. They could have at least put Enchantix on, but I guess it's not too big of a deal. Mix the logo, Bloom Pink Enchantix Nickelodeon, 11 pieces, warning sign. Then here's the bottom, some stuff, barcode. The back is really cool. And once again, they have Believe X Bloom, but they have a season one bloom, I mean season three bloom right here in the corner. Link sub logo again, Bloom Pink Enchantix. Here's the promo image. By sacrificing herself for the greater good, Bloom became an Enchantix Fairy, increasing her powers and acquiring the abilities to heal wounds and break dark magic. Then contains one doll fashion, one pair of shoes, one pair of wings, and one hairbrush. Rainbow, Nick, and Jack's logos. Winx toy website, nick.com slash Winx, the magic's in you. And if you guys notice, I'm sure you guys probably noticed, but if you didn't, she doesn't have, um socks in her promo image but the actual product has pink fishnet socks and her gloves here are solid black but here they're a black lace and I think I like this one better than the promo and so yeah they did a really nice job on the box I just wish they would have used Enchantix artwork instead of Beliefix and then here's a side view, another side view, and the top of the box. So now I'm going to unbox her, guys. And I'm going to start up here and cut the plastic from the back of the box. Hey guys, I just cut it out of the box and she is really cool. Sadly, she only comes with one accessory, which is this brush, but a good thing about this brush is it's actually different than the other ones. The other brushes were this color, and this is like a lighter pink, and I like this brush a lot better. Here's her makeup. I think her makeup is pretty much the same as Believix and Enchantix, but she does have silver eyeshadow on top, so that's a little different. Then her hair has two curls on the side, and her curls are actually kept in place by rubber bands that are um, connected, they're just like around her back. And the hair is the same um, nylon hair, but it's actually not that bad, it's pretty soft. It might not look that great in the back here, but it doesn't feel that bad at all. It's a lot better than like my Enchantix Bloom, so it's really nice I think. And she's on a Deuce Gorgon Monster High stand, by the way. And then here are her wings. Her wings are really cool. And they didn't put beads on her wings, but they, like, drew them on their, her wings, I guess you could say. Like, the beads are printed instead of hanging. And they're silver, red, black, and pink. And here's her dress. I really like her dress. It's really detailed and cool. At the top, she has a black bow tie. 
and then she has a pink material underneath that, and then here's the black material. There is some lace or fishnet lining the top of it right here, and it's all um, sparkly and glittery. And then underneath that she has a light pink layer, then like a hotter pink layer, and then another pink layer. And there's glitter all over that. And I think Jax did an amazing job with this Enchantix outfit. And her gloves are black lace too. And another cool thing about this doll is she is articulated like a deluxe doll. And her joints move a lot easier than my other deluxe dolls, I noticed. So that's cool. And then we get to her shoes. Her shoes are actually the same mold as the other Enchantix dolls, but that's okay. And they're black, so that's cool. And she also has these pink fishnet socks around her legs. And one cool thing I noticed about Bloom was her top and her um, bottom. Well, her dress is actually two separate parts, and you don't usually see that with Jack Pacific, so that's a cool thing that I did not know about. Um, the black fabric here is sewn to this here, and then th all this fabric is actually sewn to this um, mesh layer right here. So that's an interesting thing about this Bloom Enchantix style. I really like Bloom's wings because each side is almost like a different design. Here we have the pink side, and here we have like a really cool silver design, which I think is really cool. And Bloom's normal Enchantix wings are different from her pink ones. The pink ones are actually a little smaller, and they have the beads on them. So, you can sort of see the difference here. And before I leave, I want to tell you guys about a couple cool um, places to talk about Winx Club dolls and stuff. You can go to um, the Magic's Journey forum. If you guys are familiar with the website Magic's Journey, it's just um, a forum. And a forum is where you like talk about stuff um, about Winx Club. And there's like a section about the show and like the dolls and merchandise and a lot of other cool things. And um, check out Winx Doll Collectors on Facebook. And there will be links to those right here if the annotations work out right. And also, if you guys want to check out some cool official Winx Club videos, you can check out Just Another Crazy Winx Fan right here. And I'll have links to all that in the description. Oh yeah, and also, um, Ayame Kazume 21 I'm pretty sure that she told me her birthday was this month. I think it's the 28th, so... Happy birthday. Happy early birthday, but... Yeah, so thanks for watching, guys. Bye.